Welcome. We've compiled a list of 30 essential things you need to know before you buy Harvest Moon The Winds of Anthos. Check this out. Number 1. A vast open world environment with five distinct regions. Number 2. Each of the five regions is further divided into approximately 50 explorable areas, each featuring unique weather, terrain, and wildlife. Number three, some areas are initially blocked by harvest sprites or damaged bridges, requiring players to complete specific quests before gaining access. Number four, certain areas on the map appear empty and devoid of inhabitants. Number five, Extreme environmental conditions exist in some areas, such as extreme cold or heat, requiring players to prepare with specialized clothing. Number six, teleportation is possible using harvest goddess statues located in each town. Number seven, farming tools for relocating farmland are still present, allowing for more efficient management of crops, especially hybrids, akin to previous Harvest Moon titles. Number eight, while it is an open world game, it differs from typical open-world titles like Skyrim or Zelda. Shortcuts, such as climbing, are not possible. Players must follow the provided paths. Number 9. It features unique animals such as horses, bears, tigers, wolves, ferrets, and even dinosaurs that you can care for and ride. Remarkably, animals like dinosaurs can even participate in horse races. For creatures like sheep, you can save money by brushing wild animals to tame them instead of purchasing them directly. Number 10. Each mount possesses distinct abilities and weaknesses, with different terrains requiring different mounts. Number 11. The mechanism for obtaining seeds still involves the Harvest Wisp system, encouraging players to explore the diverse world of Anthos to acquire various plant seeds. Number 12. Three types of Harvest Wisps exist. Common Purple Wisps that yield one, two item seeds, rare Blue Wisps that must be obtained quickly before they flee and yield three, five item seeds, and Power Wisps that provide Harvest Wisps fruit. Number 13. Harvest Wisps. Fruit can be exchanged for stamina hearts and bag slot upgrades on the Harvest Goddess statue. Number 14. An item search feature simplifies locating specific items, including Harvest Wisps, wild items, fish, and animals, through the dock path, even in locked or unopened areas. Number 15. NPCs are dynamic, wandering and strolling around town, no more teleportation, each having unique names, making them more vibrant compared to previous Harvest Moon titles. Number 16. Stamina remains a significant mechanic, restricting players and potentially leading to frustration due to its necessity for activities such as running, farming, and fishing, especially in the early game. Number 17. A variety of activities are available to players, including farming, collecting hybrid plants, fishing, exploring, cooking, completing various quests, and, of course, socializing. Number 18. A free-form camera control mechanic allows players to freely view their character within the game. Additionally, a camera can be used for selfies and completing certain quests by photographing in-game items. Number 19. Interactive mini-games, such as fishing, feature deeper mechanics beyond mere waiting for a fish to bite. Number 20. The in-game time feels relatively short. Players are given approximately 8 10 minutes to explore the vast world of Anthos, creating a sense of urgency to complete daily activities. Number 21. Extensive player customization options include changing hair color, eye color, skin tone, clothing, and even designing your own house. Number 22. Numerous charming small details such as animated blowing winds, drifting clouds, and shooting stars at night enhance the game's atmosphere. Number 23. It takes roughly 25 hours to complete the main story of the game. Number 24. Even after completing the main story, you can continue playing the game without time constraints. Number 25. Marriage is not possible until the main story of the game is completed. There are 10 potential candidates for marriage, split evenly between males and females. Number 26. Players can have children who grow into toddlers. However, these children have pre-designed appearances and do not inherit the visual traits of the player's spouse, unlike previous Harvest Moon titles. Number 27. This is the first Natsumi-produced Harvest Moon title that supports same-sex marriage. Number 28. After the release of The Winds of Anthos, the game is set to receive updates and new DLC. Number 29. While the game was originally designed for the Nintendo Switch to run smoothly in handheld mode, it is recommended to play on other platforms such as the PS5, 
Xbox, or PC for stable 60 FPS performance. Number 30. Although not officially confirmed, the Steam page for Harvest Moon, The Winds of Anthos, indicates that the game requires an additional controller as it does not support keyboard and mouse input directly. And there you have it, folks. 30 crucial things you need to know before you buy Harvest Moon, The Winds of Antho. This game promises to be an incredible experience, and with these tips in your pocket, you'll be ready to hit the ground running. Don't forget to hit that like button if you found this video helpful and share it. Thank you.